Theft was his 20th escape from prison. First, he wrapped tape around the soles of his shoes to increase friction. Then he gets up and slowly walks towards the bars, arriving at the fence. He starts climbing quickly, because it was not the first time. The boy is very skilled. It took him only a few seconds to climb over it. Then he started to run wildly towards the woods. Soon he was over stake number one, then number two and three. But, the warder's car was right behind him. He didn't mind that much. Onward he went. But unfortunately, when he got over the last fence, he was blocked by the guards. Looking at stake number 19 on the ground, he sticks number 20 down too. This time, his escape distance increased. When he returned, the boy was put in a small dark room. The guards told him, if it happens again, the court may increase your crime. Actually, Matt was two months away from being released from prison. He had previously been locked up for robbery. He's a loner. He doesn't communicate well with others and was often bullied by the bully. So he's been trying to get out of here. In order to stop Matt from thinking of escaping again, he was given the job of caring for stray dogs by the female corrections officer. After that, Matt's mentality started to change. He groomed the dog every day, feeds him, took him for training. He also gave the dog a beautiful name, Rhubarb. But somehow, after a few days together, Rhubarb was still a bit resistant to Matt. So in his spare time, Matt began to learn about being around dogs. Gradually, Rhubarb finally accepted him. With a soul mate, Matt never thought of breaking out of prison again. He leans against a post every morning. With a single whistle, the Rhubarb would come running with excitement. But this day, it happened anyway. He blew his whistle as he always did. But after blowing several times, he didn't see the dog. Turning to look, Rhubarb was no longer in the car. The guard told him, Rhubarb had been adopted. He won't be coming back. The guards were going to give him another dog. But Matt refused. Back in his cell, Matt became increasingly agitated. He tore up his dog training book and anger, stomping all over the wooden bed. Then he gets the idea to break out of prison. He vowed he would never give the guards a chance to catch him again.